I'm Mir. I'm Sophie. And today, guys, we're reacting to Game of Thrones Season 1, Episode 4. Patreon is in the description. We're trying to make it better for you guys. Uncut reactions, early access coming to that soon. Plus to that, and I guarantee you will enjoy it. And let's get right into it. Good Brandon. Oh, we can walk now. Yeah, it's, it might, it's probably been a little time. No, but they were saying like he was never gonna be able to walk again. Oh yeah. Ah! 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 Okay. Okay. Right. <laughs> that makes sense. I was about to say. Start with a yearling and teach her to respond to the reins and to the boy's voice. Will I really be able to ride? You will. Hmm. That's really helpful. Yeah, it's like a brace thing. Yeah. I have a tender spot in my heart for cripples, bastards, and broken things. That's the name of this episode. <laughs> Don't despair. I'm a constant disappointment to my own father, and I've learned to live with it. Wow. Your next tumble with Roz is on me. I'll try not to wear her out. I feel like he really just speaks his mind, in my wow. opinion. Wow. That's speaking his mind? Yes. <laughs> to you? Yes. Disrespecting him in, in his, where he comes he about, saying, where he comes from. Or he's just saying how it is. Right. See what he can do. He about to be fired. Right, look at his face. Or maybe I'm wrong. Oh, ah! 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 oh God. Yeah. That was terrible. I, I just wanted to give some hope. <laughs> oh, ah! 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 Yeah! Oh, no! He yielded. <laughs> Even though they send terrible, terrible fighters, that's not how you should treat them. Well, of course not. Or train them. My father always says so. The wall's no place for cowards. Well, you're right. I'm sorry. Hey. I just wanted to thank you. That's literally a perfect example of parents telling you what they think of you and you believing in it and you becoming that. Yeah. That's crazy. This is my army. Cal Drogo's marching the wrong way with my army. Yeah, I'm getting tired of him. I get his passion, but like, he, he don't have no patience. I said this last time. The breath of the greatest dragon fought the Iron Throne, which the usurper is keeping warm for me. But my thing is, he's gonna have to go against the whole Seven Kingdoms to get that throne back. <coughs> I'm just wrapping that around my head. That's, he, I don't know if he's gonna be able to do that unless he got some dragons in the back that we don't know about. A pirate ship. A dragon. <laughs> no. <laughs> no, last one died many years before I was born. Oh. You know, I think I think the dragons are like the White Walkers. People think they're gone and that the last one died, but I think dragons are still there. And they go figure it out. To teach my sister how to be a better lover. You think I bought you to make Carl Drogo happy? Oh, wow. Yeah. Santa. I've told you a hundred times, a dire wolf <clears> is not... Shut up about it. Oh! You will find it in your heart to forgive your father. Forgive him? What? Oh, probably because he had to kill the dog. Okay, but he but that didn't was her want fault. to. Right, it was her fault. And John's death. Such a tragedy. Did he say anything to you during his final hours? Nothing of import, my lord. Oh. Why seem like he's low-key covering something up? Yeah. And your sons shall be nice. And princes and lords. Mm -hmm. No. <laughs> I knew she wasn't gonna agree with it. Right. Come stand by the fire. It's warmer. No, oh, that's all right. I'm fine. You're not. <laughs> you're freezing. He's scared of the wall. The edge. I mean, I don't like. I don't like that either. <laughs> On the morning of my 18th name day, my father came to me. You're almost a man now, he said. But you're not worthy of my land and title. Hey, yo. So his dad basically threw him away. Exactly. And instead of his dad helping him, he did that. And it's possible that they saw Lord Aaron visit this armorer. Lord Baelish, perhaps I was wrong to distrust you. Distrusting me was the wisest thing you've done since you climbed off your horse. <laughs> <laughs> yo, OK, so he clearly helping him out. Yeah. yeah, I feel like he knows something did happen. I mean, honestly, the way they announced it, they kept saying, like, it was a basically like a random death. That doesn't make sense. Yeah. I'd like to see him as well. As you wish, my lord. The boy. Look at me. Hmm. 
What? That's his son? Find anything? Just an interesting interaction. King Robert's bastard son. Oh, that's King Robert's. Oh. Can I leave this with you? The message from Lord Stark. I don't serve Lord Stark. That was so aggressive. <laughs> Like, out of here. The Landersers have something against the Starks. The Starks don't like the Targaryens or the Lannisters. And the Targaryens just want to want to just take over. That the rightful... Yeah. Yeah. But if Thorn puts me up against Lady Piggy, I'm going to slice me off a side of bacon. <laughs> <laughs> like, oh, my gosh. What's People the point? Like, right. what, what's the point, bro? Like, my thing is... They all gonna eventually have to work together anyway. Why make it painful? Oh! No one touches some. That was a crazy behind intimidation. <laughs> but Yo, he no, just <laughs> he's not lying though. Like they all there technically for the same reason. So yeah. it was like and like I said, what they're going against, it's better that they're strong as a unit as compared to strong individually. They got to work together. You sent this whore <laughs> to give me commands. I should have sent you back her head. Oh, my. Please. But this stinks of manure. All of it. Oh, my gosh. You do not talk back to me. <laughs> oh! oh You've woken the dragon. <laughs> Yeah, she what's is. His, him. Yeah, what's she his is problem? The next time you raise a hand to me will be the last time you have hands. Ooh. Yeah, because she Ooh. he be disrespecting her too much. I don't like that. I don't like that. He be dis disrespecting her too Benaris. much. Yeah. Okay. No, but I like girls just as much as you do. You probably had hundreds, as a matter of fact. The same as you. <laughs> yeah. yeah <I> mean. <laughs> See, he don't even think that much of himself. That just goes to yeah. show. Like, that's crazy. What if it got her pregnant? Mm. If she had a child. Another bastard named Snow. Ah. I'm not one to repeat the cycle. I like that. <laughs> <laughs> Enjoying yourselves. Yo, I hate when that when yeah. I hate when I'm doing work and then someone comes in as the minute I do something else <laughs> and it makes it seem like I'm not doing work. Do you boys even remember the last winter? How long has it been now? What, ten years? That's what I was saying, yo. I don't even So think summer is here. clearly longer. You don't know cold. Neither of you do. I mean his last name is Snow. <laughs> you come the winter. You will die. Like flies. All right, all right. This is buddy. my thing, too, though. If At least they, be a little my more. My thing hopeful. is, if they don't believe in the White Walkers, why do they still send people out? My brother will never take back the Seven Kingdoms. I, I agree with her. I feel like he's not. He couldn't lead an army even if my husband gave him one. Right. Yeah. He'll never take us home. Right. The passion is there, but that's all he has. The passion is barely there, though. Eh, In barely. the sense of, like, his overall reasoning for it isn't good enough. Like, I... I what is this supposed I, to be? Are they supposed to kill each other? I... Wait, you don't know what jousting is? <laughs> wait, did that... Oh no, I didn't think that was gonna happen. Oh my, Good. in front of everybody? Your older brother was trained to lead and you were trained to follow. I was also trained to kill my enemies, your grace. As was I. Right, basically saying it right to his face. Who was is, who is Ned Stark's older brother? John Uncle. Oh, okay. Right. I'm sorry, my lord. We'll fill up every room. My man can sleep in the stable. Oh, right. Yeah, she's not supposed to. Yeah, she's not. Truly, my lord. 
We have nothing. Is there nothing I can even though I feel like out of everybody he's the least of her worries, but I can see your father's victory, at King's Landing. Nothing would more likely ruin my supper. <laughs> Lady Stark. Bro, he knew exactly who she was. That's crazy. This man came into my house as a guest and there conspired to murder my son. Oh! I mean, I don't think it was him, it even though he him. might know, but I don't think he agreed to it. Yeah, this dad. And help me return him to Winterfell to await the king's justice. That's crazy. Yeah, and I feel bad because I know it wasn't him. Right, it wasn't him, I don't think, right? Oh. And oh. that was the end right there? What? Y'all, I'm not gonna lie to you. I kinda like that it ended right there. Because that was a good ending. Be right, because I feel like now so that's now, gonna bring up more Right. Now, concerns. now. And maybe right? he can write his own brother and sister L out. Thank you. Now Cause think about that Tyrion is under that pressure, I feel like he may start spilling like, alright, listen, it's not me. You gotta worry about and yeah. that's why people are saying they like Tyrion because he really isn't like his sister but he want, yeah. he wants to help them. Like, nah, y'all gotta watch out for them too. Well, I feel like it's about like helping, but I feel like he's more I don't of a know. like who knows. I don't like know. he like he was saying to John, how basically the same way John is seen as a bastard, he's seen as like yeah. Anybody. So I feel like he doesn't feel like he necessarily need to prove anything to anyone, but he'd rather bring the truth to people. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So like basically because think about when he's when she when he saw the son, she was he was like, You really don't remember anything? He wants him. Yeah. He really wish he That's did. why I just said that. Because I why he why is he so he's so curious about it. Right. <laughs> and then I feel like overall too, like this episode was kind of just further diving into <sighs> Sorry. To what? And to, to, to what the show was going to bring in. So, like I said, you can already tell Daenerys. I feel like she's going to get rid of her brother. I feel like he's going to end up dying. For real, for real. I, was, I wanted he... to say that, but it's so early on. I did want to say that. Well, now. just with, like, the way he's acting. And I feel like yeah. her being queen yeah. is kind of helping her give her strength, too. Because, like I said, even the way I feel like she is with that, tr the, the tribe she that she's in. She seems more in control. And yeah. He, he just but I'm like saying she dead. goes about it in a better queen aspect than yeah, I feel like does. the way Cersei do. Like, I feel like she just looks at everybody as peasants, where she's actually connecting with them. Yeah. And then... Um, also Ned, like he's very into like John well, Aaron just dying out of nowhere. Well, Ned, that's because Caitlyn is his wife just told him about what I happened. know. So of course he's very curious now. He's like, okay, whoa, I gotta figure this out because now it's like, what the heck? And what you call it coming in the queen coming in talking to him like that doesn't help that makes her look i feel like even more suspicious telling him right. like oh and more enemies like but the crazy thing is you know, yo i think it was jamie who killed him who killed john aaron yeah maybe i don't probably know it was it probably was because to, to think about that scene when when him he and his lover the sister the way he um he was saying like well i mean if he was alive i mean who would he tell they he said something along those lines remember when he was talking about the death him because the sister was at the funeral I think Jamie killed John Aaron, for real, for real, because I feel like that's like the only thing that would make sense. And like I said, there, there was, I think they purposely removed him so they can get close to Ned Stark to try to kill him. But then why would he kill the Mad King? Why would he stab? Well, the no, king I think that's, that? I think that's something, I think that's something different. Because I don't think... that king killed uh, relatives of, of the Stark, right? Of the Starks. Yeah. That king killed relatives of the Stark. So then he killed that king. I don't so think it was that's like, why. That, you don't think that yeah, was the reason I don't think he killed why, him. Yeah, cause I don't think that's why. All right. I don't really. Honestly, I, I, can't, I can't come up with a um, perspective right now of why he killed the Mad King. Mm -hmm. But that's not what I was like picking off this episode. And then, you know, they just yeah. keep reiterating on the summer's about to end. And right, I feel like right, once right, the right, summer right, ends, right. I feel like that's when the show's really going to get intense because these first few episodes, I feel like they're, they're not slow, but it's just a lot. Like, it's a to, lot to grasp, to absorb, but it's definitely yeah. not slow. Yeah, no, it's not definitely slow, not but slow. I'm saying like, it's just it's a lot to grasp. Yeah. It's, it's a lot to grasp. It's a lot of information. So. Well, hope y'all enjoyed our reaction guys to episode four of game of Thrones. Let us know anything we missed. 
Answer our questions in the comments section. No spoilers, of course. And we will see y'all on the next one. Perfect.